Hi, my name's Emma and I run the brand Streetwork, which is a brand based around designing and reworking existing garments into new pieces that can be worn again and again. I've always wanted to run a fashion brand because I love making clothes and designing clothes and I love being creative. Um, but when I was thinking about what I wanted my brand to be, I was really struggling with how to make it sustainable because I know that the fashion industry is the second largest polluter on the planet and I didn't want to keep contributing new garments into that. So when I was thinking about my brand, it was really important for me that it was sustainable and you can't really get anything more sustainable than using literal old second-hand garments and turning them into something new. So. So I started the brand at the start of 2020, just before kind of all the COVID stuff happened. Um, and it kind of happened at kind of a good time for me, to be honest, because I'd really started to like, want, my brand, want to start my brand. Um, and I'd been thinking about it for like the year prior. And I finally just started doing individual reworks. And I started actually doing something called Riff Flip Thursday, which I still do now. And it's basically every Thursday, I'd take an old garment and I'd put it up and put it into something brand new. and people responded really well to it online um, and I thought actually this could be my brand and I can, this can just be the whole brand it's, it's me reworking stuff so that's kind of like how I got started um, so yeah we're coming up to like three years in the making now um, and yeah it's going well I think it's really really important that we find new ways to be sustainable with fashion because everyone is still going to need new clothes everyone's going to need new clothes all the time um, but there's so many existing clothing items available that we really don't need to be making brand new garments all the time. Use up these existing garments, recycle them, rework them, you know, mend your own items, alter things if you, you know, if your body changes and things that fit really more, like learn to alter your clothes, just do things like that would really make a big difference um, to how much waste, post to the waste there is from fashion, um, whilst also doing things like using recycling materials if we are making new clothes. Um, I think it's just a million. There needs to be a massive change in the fashion industry where sustainable, sustainability becomes kind of the main focus of fashion and the main point of fashion, but it has to be sustainable because we can't carry, you know, carry on the way that it's going. Um, there's just far, far too much waste um, coming from the fashion industry at the moment. So when I started street work, I really did kind of want to just sell my reworks and kind of it was a real focus on. I would make a bunch of reworks and I would put them all online and make them available to buy and then I'd, you know, I'd hope that I'd pray for people to buy them. And obviously I still really do a lot of that and I really hope that people want to buy my stuff and they like it and things like that. But I, I, it has kind of shifted to now me wanting to just do tutorials and teach people how to rework things. Um, because I do think it's really important that people know how to mend their clothes and alter their clothes and look after the things they own a bit more rather than just buying new things all the time. So. That's kind of like my main focus and that's what I'm more passionate about than nowadays, although I do still love designing new things and I still get a buzz whenever someone buys something. So probably the most recent highlight that I've had was I did a seminar at Leeds Arts University to their digital fashion master's students and I was really interested to be able to talk to them about you know, what rework it is, why it's important, and um, how you can use it to you know, make new garments and things like that and it was just really, really fun to speak to these other young designers about how reworking can really become a large part of the fashion industry. Um, coming up, I should hopefully have some interesting collaborations in the pipeline with some big brands. Um, I really want to work with other brands more to use their pre-consumer waste and um, you know things like their sampling, things from their sampling process that you know they're not going to go anywhere, they're not going to be sold to any consumers. I'd really like to work with some big brands um, to kind of use up that waste rather than just focus on the post consumer waste. Um, it's all kind of equally more important. In the mill, I have my studio, I'm kind of like my workshop space, um, but I basically use the mill for everything. <laughs> to be honest, I kind of base my whole business out of here. So I have my sewing machine set up, I've got my massive pack cutting table. Um, you know, I store all of my fabric here and all of my uh, existing garments and stuff ready to be reworked. I also use other spaces in the middle to take photos of the garments um, and to like film little things. And yeah, I kind of do everything here. Um, and when I actually first came into the mill, I hadn't actually heard about the mill before I just walked through the door. And when I found out that the 
mill was like sustainable and it was like that's kind of their core focus that just felt so like this is where I'm supposed to be because it really just aligns with everything that my brand is about and everything that I kind of am about personally um, but I thought this is just the perfect space um, but it's somewhere that sustainability is at the core of it you know that's the core of my brand and also um, that the mill used to be like a textile um, sort of manufacturer as well was really cool so it's kind of all just like come together um, and I think it all just lines up really well with my brand and everything like that.